So the next event we'll be covering is the men's 20 kilometers standing cross country. And I can tell you, it was an exhausting race. I witnessed it, I watched it. It was just extraordinary. The amount of effort that went in from all these guys. You're talking 20 kilometers. You try walking 20 kilometers. It's huge. Please welcome the medalist for the cross country skiing men's 20 kilometer standing. Приветствуем медалистов по лыжным гонкам 20 километров. Мужчины в классе стоя. Well, again, all the Russian crowd here in Rosa Kator. Medals Plaza will be delighted with this. They've got another two podium finishers. Vladislav Lekomchev and also Russian Minigovlov. Split up by the Finnish man, Ilka Fomisto. So another big celebration for the Russian Federation. And as I mentioned before, it is such a demanding event this so tough 20 kilometers patrick jarvis from canada ipc governing board member of maral chareva the, the ogot vice president is in attendance Mr. patrick jarvis governing board member of the international paralympic committee accompanied by Ms. narala chareva vice president of the sochi 2014 organizing committee Medali Господин Патрик Джарвис, член правления Международного Паралимпийского комитета, в сопровождении госпожи Марала Чуривы, вице-президента Организационного комитета Сочи 2014. Bronze medalist representing Russian Federation, бронзовый призер, представитель России, Владислав. Vladislav Lekomchev, just 19 years old. He won the biathlon men's 7.5 kilometers standing. He's now picked up a bronze medal in the cross country 20 kilometers standing. Just shows his versatility. He has got the endurance as well as obviously the huge explosive sprint potential as well. At 19 years old, the future of Russian Biathlon and cross country is really in fantastic hands. Marvelous. Spasibo, he says. Vladislav Lekomchev, bronze medalist. Silver medalist representing Finland. Серебряный призер. Представитель Финляндии. Ilka Tuomisto. Ilka Tomisto for Finland, 30 years old now. In Vancouver, he won a, a bronze in the one kilometer sprint. He was fourth in Torino in this event, in the 20 kilometer standing. He really has now achieved a huge ambition. He was uh, the winner in the 20 kilometer classic style in the World Championships back in 2009 in Wakati in Finland. But this is without question the height of his career. He was Finland's flag carrier at the opening ceremony in 2010 in Vancouver. Expectations were high. He's delivered a silver medal for Finland. Rushan Minigulov, just look at the 21-year-old smile. He just cannot believe what he's just achieved. He had a really good relay event at the World Championship where he took a gold medal. But in Vancouver, he was fifth in this, this event, the 20-kilometer standing. It's now an extraordinary moment in the career of Rushan Minigulov. He was brought into the sport by his uncle Radik. And I have to say what an inspiration he must have been to see the potential champion that we now have, Rushan Minigulov, gold medal winner for Russia. Ladies and gentlemen.
and gentlemen, the anthem of Russian Federation. Дамы и господа, звучит гимн России. Ladies and gentlemen, the Paralympic medalists. Дамы и господа, победитель и призеры Паралимпийских игр. Well, he's still got three more events to go, Rushan Minigalov. I have to say, the rest had better watch out because he is in a mean mood. What an extraordinary performance. Great celebrations and lovely to see it from Ilka Tormisto as well, the 30-year-old. He has really pushed him all the way but ultimately almost 40 seconds behind in uh, in real time and certainly a deserving champion rushan minigolov in the 20 kilometer standing cross country for men